Ladies and gentlemen, this is a story that came out October 12th, 2018. The White House said they were hugely embarrassed by Trump's lunch with Kanye. And they go on and talk about Kanye's bizarre behavior and just how his overall disposition was when he was there. It was embarrassing. It was deeply embarrassing. And we already, you know, heard the stories and saw the videos. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'm here to tell you it got worse. Kanye left the White House and went over to Georgetown to the Apple store and he jumped on top of a table and started giving a speech in the Apple store about how great Trump was. He just came from the White House and he was just giving them the lowdown of how great Trump was and in his impromptu speech in an Apple store that nobody asked him for. <sighs> Following his widely publicized meeting with Donald Trump at the White House this morning, Kanye West proceeded to make an appearance at the Apple store located less than a mile from Georgetown University in Washington, D.C. Though it's unclear exactly what West was doing at the Apple store, some local reports have him there for a genius bar appointment, but that remains unverified. he did proceed to stand on top of one of the Apple signature wooden tables to deliver an impromptu keynote. Jack Jenkins, a reporter for Religion News Service, was in attendance to capture the moment with his phone and share it on Twitter. Jenkins said, West, told the crowd he told the crowd he was having a custom hat made for Trump with an edited version of his signature make america great again slogan with again cut out as it was disrespected it was disrespect to black Americans. So he wants to the hat to say, in other words, ladies and gentlemen, make America great. He says, leaving the word in again is offensive to black people. Oh boy, I don't care about no MAGA hat. I don't pay attention to them damn people anyway. But Kanye is just making a spectacle. Now you can see him standing on top of the table right here. Let me see if I can zoom this in for you. So you can get a good look. He's standing on a table in an Apple store in Georgetown. And I mean, nobody asked you, Kanye, but he gives this announcement about make America great without the word again. And in the picture, he you can he's holding his iPhone, wearing his Trump gear, saying the again part of the original slogan hurts black people. Let me tell you something. Black people are not buzzing about that stupid hat in our community. Nobody is thinking about that dumbass hat. The whole scenario seems a bit surreal, and Jenkins said it concluded 
when Wes left the store telling the crowd he was going to Africa. Nobody at the Apple store appeared to have any prior knowledge of this event or really any idea what had just transpired for that matter. Kanye got to still be on opioids, y'all. He must still be hitting the opioids. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and show you this video. Talking about making America great again. 